Shalom. Is America going to go to war with Iran? The answer is, is not so important because we know the goal, the end goal. These are all just steps to the end goal. Well, yes, there's a great chance that these two powerful nations will confront each other. But the end goal is way more exciting and way more powerful. The end goal is the coming of the Mashiach, the Messiah, may it be today. We should know that we are in a shift of reality right now. God Almighty is shifting the world as we know it to bring forth the Mashiach, the Messiah, who will be the heir to the throne of King David. He will be the king of the Jewish people, and he will be the king of the world. And he will reveal the king of kings, the king, king of kings, Hashem, to the world. He will teach the world how to be prophets like him. And we will all experience a state of prophecy and a revelation of God. And peace will be filled the earth. And knowledge of God will fill the earth. There will be no more suffering and no more illnesses. And it will be a godly era. And there is prophecies that Rome will take out Persia. Rome is America. The modern day Rome is America. The Asav, the nation that descends from Asav, which is Western civilization. And America is the most powerful nation of Western civilization. And that is Asav. Now, we have to know something very interesting. And that is that follows that the name we asked in the beginning is America going to go to war with Iran? The answer is it could. There's a great chance. There is a prophecy that America will take out Iran, will bring them down, and they will hurt them, of course. America is a very powerful nation. But the way it happens can be as sweet as possible. Of course, Israel is going to be involved too, and Saudi Arabia. There's, it's going to be a world situation. But it could happen also in a spiritual way. There's no limit to how quick it could happen. It could happen in a spiritual war. It doesn't necessarily have to be a, a suffering for you specifically. The way it happens is it can be as sweet as possible for you. If God Almighty wants you on His side, then there's no reason that you have to suffer. The suffering is for the wicked. Suffering is for the ones who are hurting the Jewish people, which unfortunately we see a lot on social media now. But if you're watching this video, this is an opportunity for you to change your ways or to continue your ways if you're already on the right path. And that is by blessing the Jewish people. And if you're Jewish, by following the seven laws of Noah. And if you're not Jewish, by... Uh, not Jewish by sorry if you're Jewish by following the laws of the Torah and if you're not Jewish by following the seven laws of Noah for all of mankind and we should know that we should learn about Mashiach learn Hasidus Hasidus is the secrets of Torah which teaches us about the divine levels teaches us about God teaches about us about our own soul and the layers to our soul and how to activate different conscious levels of our soul and bring them down into our everyday reality and through these things and also learning about Mashiach and improving our ways and, and taking this excitement and this fear of the wars that are going on and channeling it that, them into our service of God. By doing that, we sweeten the process and we bring the Mashiach. So yes, there's a good chance America and Iran could confront each other and Israel as well. But the limit there's no limit to how sweet it can go. That's the main point. There's no limit to how sweet God Almighty can make this process and how quick the Mashiach can come. He can come literally right now. And we should know we're in prophecy, prophetic times right now. It was a prophecy that America would send two massive armed ships off the coast of Israel, which already happened, has been fulfilled. This is in the book of Bilam. This is, sorry, in the book of, um, in the book of Exodus in the Torah, in the Bible, the book of Exodus, Shmois. And this talks about the prophecy of Bilam. There's also a prophecy that, there's also a prophecy that, Saudi Arabia, Iran will threaten Saudi Arabia and Saudi Arabia will get advice from America which we also witnessed that just happened recently where the Houthis threatened Saudi Arabia Saudi Arabia went to get advice from America and asked them to try to restrain to quiet the situation because they were scared so we should know that we're in prophetic times and that any moment now the Mashiach is going to arrive and you could be a part of it and God is watching you carefully and closely and watching every one of your ways examining you closely and teshuva, repentance and returning to God takes a single second. We just have to channel our hearts towards God and return to Him and follow His ways and promise to never fo go back into our sinning ways. God bless you. May we experience the redemption immediately.